when people hear Dry Dock, uh, I want them to think fun. I want them to think great beer. I want them to think great people. When people think Dry Dock, I want them to think awesome. I want them to think quality beer, world-class beer. What sells uh, Dry Dock? I think our culture is just super fun. And I think that a lot of times it's always about the story. When I was 27, I kind of flamed out of the corporate world. I was tired of working for other people. So I talked to Michelle and said, hey, I think we should purchase the homebrew shop. And it was a hobby of mine. I started brewing when I was 21. We were really, truly a speakeasy. A lot of people didn't even know we existed. They came in the front door of the brew hut and they'd be like, what's back there? I hear laughing or is that a bar? It really became like cheers. Everybody knows your name. The most rewarding thing about having this company is being able to work with so, so many great employees. We have creative freedom and we're just hanging out with our friends all day. It's like pretty much as good as it gets. It's got this great feel of just being a very close-knit, tight family even as we grow. We have created a production facility which we call North Dock. At North Dock, we can do about 10,000 barrels, 10 to 12,000 barrels in a year. So North Dock is about four times bigger than South Dock. It's hard to make great beer without starting with great ingredients. We generally order our ingredients uh, from the country of origin for that beer style. So you can't really get any more authentic than that. We don't skimp on ingredients. We don't trade out one malt for a cheaper malt just because we can and we'd save a few dollars. We don't, we use quality ingredients. And so I want people to think that's great beer. I get to work with super amazing people every day. It's really fun. We have this great commonality of being super passionate about craft beer. We've had such loyalty both from customers and employees that we've had a few customers get dry dock tattoos and one of them Mike now works for us up at the production facility. It didn't hurt having a tattoo when you applied for a job. We've been very lucky. We've had a lot of great customers. They really feel like it's their brewery. A lot of customer ownership. We are Aurora's brewery. And so when you look at you know places where you can have this type of experience, we're really it. I think that's been a, a very big part of why Aurora's really embraced Stridock.